Hey, I want to tell you about the biggest lie that people tell themselves and tell other people. And that's not only one of the biggest lies of uh, humanity, but also something that is disempowering and makes you a victim, victim of life, of, of the world. And if you watched my previous video, you probably know what it is. Uh, so make a guess, what is the biggest lie that people tell themselves? Okay, the biggest lie is I don't have time or I don't have time for this. And I know it's a useful expression, it uh, makes things shorter, but if you keep telling yourself this, you will always tell it to yourself and to other people and uh, you will forget that it's just a way of speaking and you will make it your reality and, you, and it will be always, oh, will you do that for me? No, 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 I don't have time. Oh my God, I'm so busy, I'm stressed because I don't have time. Oh my God, have you done this? Oh no, I haven't done it. Oh my God, when will I find time for this? and so on and so on. So what can you do instead? Well, very simple and as my regular viewer you should probably know, uh, think of a different way of saying that. See first of all, realize what is the truth. There is no such a truth like I don't have time, like what did God just come and say Mary, Jimmy or Johnny Helen, I'm gonna take one hour away from your day today, you will have only 23 hours today. You know, it doesn't happen. So what is happening is that you have chosen certain life and you have chosen certain things you want to do, accomplish certain goals and you only have 24 hours to achieve those things. And where you put your attention, how effective you are with those things will determine the outcome, right? So the truth is you have time 24 hours a day and you choose how to use it. And some people I know will start arguing, yeah, but I have to sleep, I have to eat. So what? Everybody has to do it, you know? It's not uh, something that, you know, uh, you are somehow different, you know? Everyone has to eat, drink and do other things. And some people, in spite of that, they manage to build Microsoft, Tesla, SpaceX or other big companies, whereas others, they just <laughs> don't do anything. They just, you know, don't build much, don't achieve much, you know? So prioritize your things, that's how you that's how you achieve things. So the truth is, um, you always have time and you need to choose to. So you have a situation, you need to tell someone that you don't have time for something, but the truth is that you just don't wanna do it, you don't wanna spend your time, you don't wanna allocate your time to this thing because you want to do something else. So how can you do it? You just tell people, hey, this is not something I really wanna do, or this is not something I wanna do right now, or I'd, I'd rather focus on, on something else that's more important to me. Hey, I have other priorities. I, I'm, I'm really grateful for the invitation. I appreciate it, but I'm, I won't be able to do it because uh, uh, I, I, I need to do some other things that are more important to me or to somebody else or, or whatever. So that will force you to think about what is really going on in your life. And when you realize what's really going on, what will happen? you will be in charge, you will have power to do something about this. Because if it's like, I don't have time or I have to, you are the victim, you're not in control. The time is in control, the, I don't know, some magical force that forces you to do things is in control, but not you. But when you take the, when, when you see what's going on, which is you do have time and you have control, you don't have to do anything, you only choose to do things, and suddenly you can say, oh my God, yes, I can choose to go to work, uh, even, if, even though I don't like it. I can choose to be pleasant to people, even though I don't like them. I have time, I can just allocate my time to things that are really important and simply refuse to do anything else that's not important, that's not aligned with my goals. If someone, if my boss comes to me and gives me another task, then you will say, hey, is this more important than this? Or, or is this more important? Because I, I don't think I'll be able to do all those things. I can only do one or two of those things. Which are, which one is more important? So no more saying I don't have time and then arguing with your boss or whoever else. You just say, hey, I don't think I'll, I will have enough time to do it. Which one is more important? And it's a very different conversation suddenly because you then <laughs> force them to give you to choose for you which one is more important and then they will have to tell you okay this one is more important and then this one and this one so if you don't do it well you haven't done it because you were focused on doing some other things that were more important simple as that okay very different conversation right i'm i know it, it's been helpful for you and if you want me to help you uh 
organize your day, focus on priorities, and first of all, choose really important goals in your life, because this is where people fail. People don't choose the right goals or they don't have goals at all. And um, I'm going to help you choose really good goals for you and I'll help you to achieve it. Just send me an email to kamil at kamilsview.com and let's talk about this. Your life is at stake. You know, thanks for watching and, and for your lovely comments. Take care, guys.